Hi everyone, I'm Sundray9, and welcome back to Let's Play Valtherian Arc 2. Now, before we really get started, over here I am going to build a farmhouse, which gives additional income, and if you students visit it, you get uh, plus the stats. So, we're going to do that. There you go, farmhouse. That's neat looking. Uh, the next thing I'm gonna do is we have, <coughs> excuse me, we have uh, a new student to to get. So let's start recruiting. Yes, charming. Uh, increased chance to perform skill. That could be handy. Uh, int. Is decent. I'm looking for a high int. Party failed. Okay. I thought we had everybody back. I guess not. Uh, do we have everybody back now? Looks that way. Okay. Uh, that's fine. And we're gonna. Let's see. Plus physical. Yeah, int's really going up. Perfect. when we spend our AP on. Good, alright. It looks like high int. No, I don't want to graduate this student. So I have a new student. Uh, going to be named Dr. Fresh. So welcome to Starlight Academy. And going to be a Magi. Yes. Good. Uh, magic stick. And magic rope. Congratulations. And again, welcome to Starlight Academy. I could do with an upgraded... Well, instead of doing that, I could build a new classroom. Lounge. Uh, we can build a... Uh, build a classroom here I suppose classroom yes good just so we have room for uh, more students if need be and since it's not cheap to upgrade it but compared to how much gold we have right now. We'll upgrade the classroom as well. There we go. Six extra spots. Now, I'm just going to let you students go ahead and uh, study and uh, go over some you know, study in your respective training rooms or visit the farmhouse or a canteen or whatever. I'll leave it to your own devices. Because there's something I need to talk about. About last episode. If you noticed last episode, there were not the typical sidebars that I kind of have over over on the sides of the screen. Or is it Cinder 89 and all that? And if you also noticed, uh, you didn't see the annotations that I usually do where, uh, well not usually do, but that I'm doing for this, this LP, where I uh, play a starlight and do annotations and that's because well I uploaded the wrong video <laughs> Good job me. That's right your LP are completely failed so <laughs> Now all the video is the same and all of that All that all of that's the same so uh, When I edit the video I put the sidebars and the annotations so There's that you didn't see uh, starlight and uh, one of you asked in the comments and brought it to my attention. Thanks, Desk. I appreciate it. <clears throat> I don't know how many of you read the annotations, but I do. I do put uh, time into it to put myself in that mindset and uh, play as that character, and I really enjoy it. And it's something that I really. 
uh, really enjoy doing, but it is time consuming, and so I do hope you read the annotations. I don't have like a, spe a sound effect or anything. I know that would help. I've kind of been thinking about that, like having a little sound effect whenever I uh, Starlight talks, but I don't have anything like that yet. The main thing is, I want to apologize to Starlight. So, Starlight. Starlight? Oh, come on. I know you're angry with me. I already apologized. See, I told everybody I screwed up. Oh, come on. I said I'm sorry. I know you're angry. It is your academy, after all. Yes, I know. We need to impress Big Sis. Big Sis stirs. I got it, but... Okay, I'll tell you what. To make up for it, I'll let you have a special comment, and you can tell a story. Yes, no strings attached. You can tell a story, you can do whatever it is you do here at the Academy, and you can let the students respond to it, you can just have fun, whatever you want to do to make up for it. Okay, that'll, that'll work then. <laughs> So, everyone, the first comment for this episode for Valtherian Arc 2 will be our mascot slash, uh, not superintendent, but, uh, who the Academy is named after will be Starlight giving, uh, a story like some of you are doing. So, please read, and it should be a lot of fun. Who knows? what the baby dragon has has ready to go <laughs> and of course as always watch for his comments down here he makes funny comments uh, and sometimes just brings a different perspective to things so anyway that's what happened last episode I really wanted to address it and let you know that well I messed up <laughs> just in case some of you were wondering because I know I know at least one of you was wondering and in case any of the rest of you were wondering. So, now that that is out of the way, and that, I don't know if it's just the farmhouse, but man, that really does help, uh, Desk. You were right. We already gained, what, like 5,000, 5,000 coins, so, hey. Alright, so, now let's, uh, begin this episode, now that I'm, uh, through trying to uh, make Starlight not angry at me, which he has every right to be, because my screw up, you couldn't see what he said all last episode, and he had some good things to say last episode. We're going to uh, begin on a new set of hunts because we, at least for the time being, have finished the uh, Paladin arc. It seems we're all just going to take turns still. Well, that's not true. I'm going to still be training the Paladins at this point. Uh, until something happens. Now. Time to start a new... A new uh, quest line. Let's try... That was really tough. Um... Hmm. Let's continue the monster Scotland. Continue our fighting in the monster Scotland. Can you face a group of bears and yeti? Uh, before that, we'll send some people out on errands. Uh, banquet for the warriors. Let's send. Um. A list here, actually. Hmm. Warriors. So we want to send some some knights and such. We'll send Alex. We'll send Sparks. That one guy and Bloodlight. Yes. 
uh, Dragon Quest. We'll send some of our stronger, uh, stronger people. We'll send, uh, MG... Calveric, Carson, and Dark Knight. Yes. Uh, what else do we have? An Old Woman's Journey. Let's go ahead and do that one as well. Let's send Flutter. Uh, Marietta. Carter, and... Fish pasta. Yes. And hellish homework for uh, Dr. Fresh, Dalazar, Mist, and Kira. Shouldn't be a problem. <clears throat> okay. Now there's a few other things we need to do real quick. Such as Siren, I think it's time you became a paladin. Yes. So, congratulations! Let's get you properly equipped. Uh. Sure. Falchion. And. Hmm. Gives you more int. Uh, Legionnaire armor. There we go. Congratulations. And also, Dark Fox. It's time to change your class, so congratulations. There we go. Uh, you need a rifle. I'm gonna spend the AP, which is a lot of AP, to get you to level 25 so you can have the, uh, soldier rifle. There we go. Training suit? No, you need a... Gives you a lot of decks. Yeah, sniper camo. There we go. So, congratulations. All right. Um, due to the money situation, that's really all I can do now. I really wanted to upgrade uh, Onik as well, but I wouldn't really be able to equip him. I don't think. We can check real quick. Shaman, yes, 4,800. All right, that's fine. Here we go. Monster Gauntlet 3, we're going to send our uh, new Paladin, Onik, Nala, and Dark Fox, our new Rifleman, or Arquebusier, hope I said that right. I did practice a little bit, but still not, still not good when you can't, can't hear it. Anyway, let's go. Good job. Oh, good. Success. 7,000 XP, 800 fame, 3,000 gold. Alright, let's see what our uh, new uh, graduate students can do. Kill enemies. Here we go. Yeti and ogres. This will be interesting. Now, love, stay back. Don't get hit. Okay, the heel's ready for when Siren needs it. There we go. Everybody gain uh, EXP back. Heal. Good. With Nala's high int, that the ultimate charges really fast, <laughs> which is good healing. Whew. That was a- those ogres are no joke! Protected. 
Good. Well done. 5,000 EXP, 400 fame, 2,800 gold. That was not easy. Uh, level up for Siren and Nala. Glad about that Leech and Air armor, because anything less may not have cut it. <laughs> 3,200 EXP, 150 fame, 600 gold. Okay. Monster's Gauntlet 4. Continue our fighting in the Monster's Gauntlet. This time you'll face a group of fierce ogres. Uh, now that we have the money, let us uh, change Onyx class. It, he wanted to be a Scholar Sage. Yes. So, congratulations. Shaman Wand. And a Sage Mantle. Good. That's ready. Let me see here as I grab my... <laughs> boost and boost again. I'm going to upgrade Mist. Because he is one of the other few to be uh, wants to be a medic so congratulations uh, don't quite have enough for the shaman wand and since you're 21 we can't give you the wizard robe the boost in int will be nice Oh yeah, you, you don't even have the level for the Sean one. A uh, little more money. I'll soon until other students come back. And yes, I just noticed the <laughs> the sound. There we go. Better. Um, student list. Yeah, that's what I wanted. No. Student list. Zero weeks. One week, zero weeks. Okay. Yay, it's our new medic. Who, as soon as something comes back, will have enough money for the arc one. Come on, shouldn't be that much longer. Uh, let's set up another errand then. Uh, good impressions. Send Dr. Fresh, Dalazar, Kira, and Tina to Mara. This was your Good job. There we go. 8,000 fame. Uh, 8,000 EXP. 1,000 fame. 2,400 gold. Good. <laughs> Arc one. Good. Okay, let's see. All right. Let's continue with the monster gauntlet. This will not be easy, I assume. Uh, we'll take Siren. Uh, Flutter, since you came back, we'll take MG and Nala. Good luck, students! Oh, these are fierce ogres. Okay. Kill everybody. Oh, 
Oh, jeez, that's not good. Meteor! Well, we tried. Yeah, that got hairy quick. Jeez. There was somebody else in there, like they had a caster or something, too. Okay. 9,000 XP, Fire Fame, 2,400 gold. We'll skip out on the rest of the monster guy. These arcs get really tough. That's... <laughs> well, skip out on the rest of that one for now. Uh, I do have way, a way better feeling about this quest, though. Material Girl 2. We have had trouble with it before, but I think the students can handle it now. We'll take Flutter, MG... Uh... Get together. I need to upgrade your equipment, Sparks. Siren. And Nala. Oh, just three. Oh, yeah, that's right, because we're escorting. Um, Flutter, Siren, and I definitely want the healer, so Nala. Don't remember who went last time, but... Yes. Okay, you three. Let's show these ogres uh, just how much you've improved. So I think this was the team I sent last time, but I don't remember. Ready. What was that? That was really weird. Roger. Yeah, we know this is the easy part. What's this here for? That's interesting. Alright, here are the ogres. Let's go. Yeah, Kayla's ultimate doesn't help. Heal? Yeah. Tick. Yes, there we go. Good. I'm pretty sure we didn't even have to fight the ogres that time, but you know what? It was worth it. Yes! <laughs> Another set of material collected. Well done, students! As with the last one, you'll find the newly forged armor in the armory soon. Good job. Good. 4,000 EXP, 300 fame, 2,700 gold. Good job. 3,000 EXP, 150 fame, 600 gold. Alright. Uh, let's see this uh, new armor. High Monk Robe. For our Scholar Sages and Medics that are level 28. Awesome, I like that. Uh, Kabaya, this beautiful robe is worn by the people from the East in ceremonies. The High Monk Robe has more defense, but this has slightly more int, but less defense. That's interesting. Hmm. Leak Mask. Uh, this mask is modeled after a feared demon in Eastern mythology. Interesting for our, uh, our Bus ears. Monkey King. A ceremonial suit from an East Country Folk Tales. Okay. Uh, this one gives Int, so you can charge up your special moves faster. But the Monkey King gives physical and dex, and also more defense. So I think I'm going to go with this. Pious Ag Agon? Wow, game, you really want to challenge me today, huh? For our paladins, a very unique set of ceremonial armor worn in rituals on the islands of Kawaya. Uh, physical and int and defense, but also the same level Savage Lord. An armor set that mimics those used by savages in the Outer Land. Uh, even though I really don't like the name, the armor looks awesome and it gives a ton of defense. More physical, a little less int, but it gives a lot more defense, so I think we're going to go with Savage Lord. Honestly. 
And there we go. There's your uh, new armor, students. Very cool. Material Girl 3. I need some materials to make a new armor set. You don't mind, right? I need something sparkly now. Okay. Uh, we can send four students this time. So, uh, let's send... Well, you know what? Since we we do have some money... Uh, Alex D? Congratulations, you're now a paladin. Falchion and... You're 28, so you're going to be the first one to test out our new armor. A savage lord. Yes. All right. Good. Um, and now we're broke again, so that'll do. <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, I need to... What I'm going to be doing, I'm going to recruit some more students, but... Uh, these are just going to be NPC students right now, anyway. Oh, Faithful! Have more defense rate. Neat. Except that way I can uh, train them up and then send them uh, and then graduate them to get uh, to get funds and uh, fame because if we get a lot of that from uh, graduating students okay so let's send those two students on an errand an easy errand Housekeeping. Duh, duh. Dr. Fresh, you can look over them and we'll send Kira. Uh, strong warrior needed. Oh, we'll send you some strong warriors then. Uh, Siren. Sparks, that one guy, and Bloodlight. There, you wanted strong warriors? I'm sending you strong warriors. <laughs> Uh, I saw the Dragon Quest one. We'll do that. We'll send a uh, Flutter Sniper. MG. Calvaric and Marietta Fate. Or no. We'll send our new uh, Medic to help you. We'll send Mist. Yes. Out there is Night Patrol. And Dalazar, Samoke, Tina Tamara, and Fish Pasta. That is four Magi. Just blast anything that goes wrong. <laughs> Alright. Something shiny. So, we'll send our new very shiny paladin, Alex. We'll send Onik. We'll send Nala and Dark Fox. Yes. Again, a balanced team. Yeah, performing a quest will automatically take up time. Mission start. Alright, here we go. Alex, you lead the way. Okay. All right. Oh, the heel's already ready. Excellent. Something shiny. Where's the tough enemy? All right, well, these are tough enemies, but our series are just properly prepared. And another set. I'm drowning in materials. Like always, you'll find the newly forged armor in the armory soon. Good job. 4,800 EXP, 300 fame, 2,700 gold. Almost levels level up. For three of you, jeez. <laughs> good job. 7,000 EXP, 800 fame, 2,700 gold. Good. And that one failed. That's okay. Material girl four. <laughs> First, let's see what uh, she has. A bear costume, really? 
a costume mimicking the appearance of a bear. It's unknown whether this is effective or not. It gives a ton of defense though, I'll give it that. <laughs> beggar outfit. A camouflage that makes the wearer look like a beggar. Okay. Why? <laughs> These are level 32. Gladiator male. The armor worn in by fighters in a traditional Reth Ramatharian tradition for the paladin. Yeah. I don't really get the beggar outfit. I know sometimes they go an undercover. All right, snipers, but come on. And the bear costume just really throws me off. Uh, nurse costume. Costume that lulls enemies, mostly males, into a false sense of security. Ha ha ha. For <clears throat> female medics. Though I'm not going to make you wear that. Orc costume. Uh, an armor set worn by ogres made from the hardest of leathers and bones. Yikes. Thug costume. A costume mimicking the appearance of street thugs. Does offer some degree of protection. See, I think this would have made more sense for the scouts. You know, j just lower the level and make these the scout costumes. Or not, not costumes, but you know, make these the scout armors. Because they want to blend in. Because they're scouting? I don't know. I don't know. That, that makes more sense to me. Oh well, not too thrilled about those armors, but... Oh, jeez. It's the run of bad luck there. That's okay. Material Girl 4. Yes, it's Kayla again. And it's another request to make another set of armors. Only it gets a bit dangerous now. The material's in a cave. But the cave is filled with dangerous monsters. Well, let's see how dangerous. Alright. We have a few people that have reached max level. So congrats to Siren and Sparks. Uh, the first to reach uh, max level. So, let's send Alex. He's not max level. Flutter, MG, and Nala. Let's go with that. Wow, just a string of bad lucks there on the on the errands. Deliver a new message or adventure, be sure to check with him often. Who? <laughs> Fifteen enemies. Alright, students. Okay. What kind of enemies are we looking at? Y'all look different. Alright. Did what wow, I, I could have just just let just let MG just blast that ogre. Oh, I see you. No, no, no. I don't like y'all anymore. The fierce ogres. I'm you can gone. go away. See what's down here. Hi. Seems to be different colored ogres, but I really don't see a difference. I'm uh, the dark ones seem to be a bit tougher, but they don't freeze either, I don't think. Like the, uh... Like the other ones. Fire. <laughs> okay, three more. Here we go. Again, that is just a shame. Whatever's being targeted is where the spells should go. <laughs> more materials. Thanks. Like always, you'll find the newly forged armor in the armory Good soon. 5,600 EXP, 300 fame, 2,700 gold. Max level, max level, max level. Congratulations. Alright. Uh, really? Iron Pants. Only the purest of mine will receive the highest protection. 350 to fit. No! Why, game? Why? Less armor doesn't mean more protection. I hate it when games do that. Ugh. Really? Sexy lingerie? Kayla's no. Okay, principal. I don't understand why people go into battles in their lingerie. But I see it often 
maybe just maybe it works? No! No, it did. It, it, uh, in, in games, for some reason, it works sometimes, but it shouldn't work! <sighs> I will not force my female students to wear that. Underwear! The wise man said that the protection is a state of mind, not armor. By forgoing armors, you are putting confidence in your body. No! Less armor doesn't mean more defense. <sighs> With that out of the way, and I was warned about that. We're gonna move on! No! I'm not equipping any of your st you students with that. No! Not happening. Not force you to degrade yourself like that. Material Girl 5. Principal, this is Kayla, and this is the final set of armor. I promise, I just need some drape scales. <sighs> okay, alright. Alex, Flutter, MG. Nala, I'm sending you three on this one because you're the, you're the uh, best equipped right now. Well, almost the best equipped. You're the highest level. And this sounds really difficult. So I'm going to send my best. We must believe they can do it. Well, let's believe. You can do it, students. Oh, and this is something that was uh, told to me by Desk in the comments. So, uh, thanks a lot. If you're in combat, I'm going. You can double click and the students will okay. force move. See how it turns red? Which means they'll stop attacking and move regardless. Which is something I've been wanting. I wish the game would say that somewhere. Because I think that's a very vital technique. If things are going badly, you can maybe try to retreat. Like back here and okay. recover. Or at least buy buy your medic some time to get her ultimate. Just a thought. It's a Drake. They hurt. <laughs> Why am I shocked by this? I shouldn't be shocked by this. I'm going. There. Oh god. Now four at the same time. MG, come here. Meteor. Ultimate. Heal, yes. See, again, by time. Meteor. Heal. Good. Whew. I want everybody to have their ultimate. <laughs> Gee, they're drakes. Of course they're going to be tough. I mean, they're no match for a dragon, even a baby one such as Starlight, if you ask me. But they're still drakes, and they're not to be messed with, period. I mean, these are some of the highest uh, students we have at the academy. And you can see even they're having a tough time. I'm going. Hi! Was that the warm up? I'm going. Oh, here we go. Good! Well done, students! And that's it. I have all the materials to make all the armors in the book. Good work, students! This'll be one hell of an armor. Just check it in the armory. 7,200 EXP, 400 fame, 6,000 gold. Almost a level up for Nala. In fact, I'm going to spend AP. Menu. Yes. Okay. Alright, let's see what Kayla cooked up this time. Be something a lot better. Kawaii Soul. A robe gifted to those who perform heroic deeds in the islands of Kawaii. 
uh, 150 defense for scholar sages and medics or 150 defense 40 physical 30 dex 65 int awesome i love the way it looks too it just looks cool too excellent ramathir pride a ceremonial armor given only to the highest order of the ramathar kingdom wow for the uh arquebusiers that's really fancy a ton of decks 175 defense it and physical i'm sure it's still light enough for all of you to move around in and provides excellent defense of course these are all level 30 armor and expensive to boot uh valther wig a uh, wing valther wing sorry a ceremonial armor given to the honored heroes of Valtheria. Our paladins, of course. 300 defense. 55 physical, 55 dex. <clears throat> Excuse me. And it just looks like somebody with a lot of experience and uh, somebody high ranking wearing this. Awesome. And that's it. Those are the. Uh, probably all the armors we did all of her armor quests and those are the uh, biggest armors you can get so kawaii soul it still doesn't give as much defense as this really really game gives better stats so we're and it looks way more awesome so we're definitely wearing that paladins as your instructor <laughs> right now that's what i'm saying about their wing it even sounds cool so anyway uh, that's what you students will be wearing at level 30 uh, for your respective classes. Valther Wing, Ramathir Pride, or Kawaii Soul. They all look great. I think they're awesome armors. And that's going to do it for this episode. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Had a lot of fun. We're really starting to knock these arcs, arcs out as much as we can anyway. Thanks, Monsters Gauntlet. <laughs> Uh, but we're really starting to to get into these uh, into these arcs and seeing these storylines, getting stuff, and you students are really really doing great. We have some quite a few uh, maxed out students at level 30. Some of you that are close. There's still a lot of you I need to class change. Uh, we'll do that when <clears throat> money allows. I really want to get because. Of the damage that all of you are taking I really want to build the defender statue and we're close actually for increased defense I, I really want to do that so that's next on the on the list so well done everyone all of you going on the on the uh, the hunts or the errands uh, you're all doing a fantastic job and really just look at how far you've come you all started out as level one apprentices just think about that that makes it sound like this this LP is is close to being over far from it we've got lots of arcs to do and I want to tackle them all so uh, next time we'll choose a new arc to try to go down and see what's going on there's still quite a few to choose from and go on more errands build some more things here at the Academy and continue on so again thank you very much for watching I hope you enjoyed I hope you had a lot of fun until next time I'm Cinder 9 remember to shoot for the stars and take care everyone <laughs>